Well, the problem today is there's a crack rock right here. Just move your leg. Yeah, right here. See that? That's what that is. That's a crack rock. How much more do you have in the car? That's it. That's it? Mm -hmm. Just one crack rock? Mm -hmm. That looks like that was one too right there. Eleven eighty seven middle six. Do you have an ID on you, sir? Eighty uh, five mil. License or anything? No. Nothing at all? Gotta have something. So, the way this works in Vermont when I have probable cause to search a motor vehicle, okay, is you can allow a search now, or you can require that I seize the vehicle in the entirety of its contents, which means literally everything in the car, like absolutely everything, including you guys. Um, so you can allow me to search the vehicle and its contents here at roadside, or you can require that I seize everything and apply for a search warrant from a judge, and the choice is yours. But uh, those are your two options here this evening, now that I saw that crack and have it here. I mean, just from your reaction, I've done this for 28 years, and just from re your reaction, I already know there's more in the car. I mean, it's pretty much a, a known fact to me at this point. It's just what quantity and, and where it is in the car, which, uh, you know. It, but the choice is yours. I mean, I'm not going to tell you which one to choose. It would probably take us somewhere in the vicinity of 20 to 30 minutes to search both of you in the entirety of the car here at roadside. Um, or if you require that I seize the vehicle and apply for a warrant from a judge, then it's probably not going to be till tomorrow or even sometime over the weekend whenever a judge uh, decides to take a look at it, the warrant. But again, it's totally up to you. How much more do you have in the car? I mean, there's obviously more in the car, so. Because if there wasn't more in the car, then the answer right off your lips would have been, sure, go ahead and search it. There's nothing else in the car. And that wasn't what just happened, so I know there's more in the car. As a police officer with almost 30 years' experience, so. That's probably older than both of you, huh? You guys aren't 30 years old yet, I would assume. I've done this for a living, you know, drug work, so. What's that? You want me to search the vehicle and its contents? Get it over with? Yeah. Okay. Can I get a yep, why don't you step? Yeah, where's your sweatshirt? Here we go. Here we go. That's, a, that's an ounce, you say, huh? Yep. Oh, here we go, bud. There it is. That's 95, everybody. Okay, everybody with their hands behind their back. Put your hands behind your back. Okay, well, this is what I found. Hopefully the camera can see it. It's a bunch of crack in here. 
nice bunch of crack. It's a good, it's a good, good grab right there. I'm going to uh, go grab some that's, bags. I would say that's an ounce of weed. And that is uh, coming out of uh, the gentleman from Massachusetts bag. I don't remember his name again. He told me once, but I don't remember. They both gave permission to search the entirety of the vehicle, their persons, and the contents, so yes. Because they both gave permission, we don't have to ask them individually uh, about each bag. I think this is probably going to be it, but it's worth... That was the one that gets feet. Yeah. 